So what we'll be doing today is going to be uh, how to generate a character, then rig it, then um, make animation without having or without the knowledge of all these things. So all the things we'll be doing is going to be automated or automatic or generated um, characters and animation. So stick with me. The, the, the first thing we're going to be using is going to be um, Mixamo Fuse. So this is where we we'll generate our character. So uh, for, you know, just to be funny about it, I, I think I like, uh, I'm just going to create, um, okay, uh, let's follow um, the animation uh, we just saw. So I'll be using this guy, Tsun Mail, something like a cartoon. So this is what we'll be using. So I'll go to the body. This is the matched body or compat uh, compatible uh, body with the head. So after this, this is the leg that is compatible with it. And um, this is the hand that is compatible with it. So after these two, I don't want to, you know, um, you can actually edit all these things. You can edit all these things. You can make the nose bigger, make the head bigger, whatever you want to do like that. You can make them bigger in, in um, um, doing it from this side. You can as well go to customize and um, Click on the head, then maybe backward, make the head uh, big to the back, something like that, just to make it more funny, you know. So that is um, how um, I um, ended up with, I can click the nose, select the nose, then make it longer or smaller. Since it's an African character, uh, African, male African character, so I want to make the nose a little bit smaller. I can make it bigger, actually. So. Um, I think I, I, I like it this way, cheek, the cheek I can make it go up or to the front. So you can actually do all these things, the chest I can make it go up and a little bit wider. So whatever you want to do, the back, I love to have the back wider like that. So um, pretty much that is all you can what you want to do whatever you want to do to it so uh let's look for a simple clothes so uh, what i'm doing is i'm trying to you know make my work faster and not have a lot of um you know polygon so that is why i'm choosing all these things um it's much more so i'll go to the bottom and look for a very short and nice um yes i can do i can use that so i can use this so I can go to the shoe. Actually, the one I I did didn't have a shoe, but I can give it the shoe like this, like so. So uh, pretty much that is it. The hair, I don't want to give it the hair to add extra polygons to it. Hat, I don't need this. Uh, eyewear, I don't need this. Beard, I don't need this. Glove mask, um, uh, uh, mustache, I don't need that. So texture, I don't really need. I don't want to do anything on the texture. So let's move on. So uh, what I would do is, because I'm working offline, so I'll go to my um, uh, file and say uh, export. What is it? File. Export. So it's exporting OBJ. So I want to pack the texture alongside. So I don't want a big texture um, quality. So the size is, is OK that way. So I would say save default. Save default and say okay so um, i'll call it uh, let me call it uh, tutorial so let me just call it tut o2 so i'll save so it's saving so after i'm done with that i will go to let's check let's check it uh Suits. So this is it. This is the OBJ and this is the texture that I packed. And I said pack textures. So these are the textures. So uh, I'm not. I'm not going to be using um, the normal map and um, the uh, spe uh, specular. I, I, I'm not interested in this. I'm interested in just um, the texture because I want it to look uh, more like a cartoon without the unnecessary details. So now I'll go to. Uh, my browser, I'll go to Mixamo because 
the app as well is a Mixamo app. So I can you can log in. You have to have a, a login detail. So I'm going to log in. So I'll log in. This is the one I did uh, previously. So but I'm not interested in this. So let's change it. So I'll go to um, upload character and say OBJ, obviously. So I'll go to where I have the guy, um, suits O2, and this is the OBJ. So I'll open it. So I'm uploading the uh, character. Now you see it's faster. So I have, I should have my character in just a moment. So it's loading. So this is the character that I have. This is the character. So, uh, so but for better character, for uh, to have your character in T post for better results, have your character in T post. So that is the T post that I have. So let's go to next. So this is for chain. I'll take it to the chain. Uh, this is um, um, right wrist. So it, it should mirror. So I have it there. Um, right elbow, I'll take it to the right elbow, like that. Um, I have the knee, right knee. This is my knee. Then I have the groom. So it should be between the um, the the waist and um, you know the lower part of uh, the body. So that is it. So I'll say next. So it's rigging now. So this is it now. So you have it here. So to test it, um, just say next, then find some uh, um, some animation, this reaction. So let's see. So we can see, you can see, I think it's cool. We are right. This is perfect. So you go to download. So download with screen. So I love to work in 24 frames per second. So I'll choose it. So with screen, so and say download. So after the download, um, I think we're done with that. So we we'll go to. So I'm. I, I'm going to be using um, the uh, the last project, the last one I did. That's what I'm going to be using. So um, I'll go to the last, the one I did, Yoruba. So uh, this is the guy here. This is the guy. But the running, uh, I use running. So this is it with um, the skin. So running. So I'll bring it in. So this is the guy here running that's uh, what i did running so now uh the issue is we have to have i want to have this in tipos not necessary it's not necessary but in case you have uh more animation that you downloaded that you want to use on this character it has to be on tipos for initial um uh, post so to do that we are not going to be using the tipos but to do the tipos um uh, Let's come to this place, uh, X-ray joints, so that you can see the X-ray. So I'll click the middle, the center, which is um, like the hip of uh, the character. So right click on your mouse and go to select hierarchy. Select hierarchy, so you can come to the rotation from X to Z and say zero and enter. So you can see this is the T-post. In case you have more animation aside the running, uh, that you want to use probably it's running and has to fall down so you have um running initially then you have um fall down so it has to be from this place so that you can uh be able to do uh uh character um definition great character definition so i have tutorials on this uh, you can check it down below uh so uh, i'll press ctrl z to go back so what i will do now is go to create and say uh say locator locator so i will scale it up and bring it to this guy here so from this side so i'll press um i'll click on the mixamo if then um, um shift click on the locator and say uh P, press P to parent it. So I have the so wherever I move this to, it should go back. So I, I'll go to uh, perspective and scale it down because it's so massive and I don't like that. I want it to be as small as 
possible. But if you want it to look more realistic, you can use the actual weights uh, or actual um, size, actual measurements, light measurements. So by going to the settings and go to um, settings here, so this centimeter, you can, you can go to inch so and say save. So this is, you have the actual life, real life size this way. So and this guy, let's say this guy is around, uh, let's say is a little boy, not really um, um, an adult. So I can say I want him to be, um, say, um, four inches. So, or yes, four inches. So um, one um, unit is an inch now. So one, two, three, four. So it has to be this height. So I'll select this. And bring him down to that height so that's four so that is four um four inches so this guy is four inches so whatever i'm bringing in has to be with um the value of this guy so i think i have him now so you can now bring other um other assets um that you want to use like um the dog the, the buildings uh, and everything like that so let's say <clears throat> Uh, I want to have a building, so I just create a box just for um, the purpose because it's all about this guy here. So I can create a box here, um, create a box, take it to the back, let me do it from this side. So let's say the height of the building is about 10 inches 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, let's say level. So that's um, the usual height of buildings um, um, in Nigeria, I would say. So, um, so that is it. So I can duplicate and move it behind. I can duplicate, move it behind. So that was how I placed the building. Then um, the, the, what's it called? The dog is chasing in or it's just running for the purpose of this tutorial. Say it's just running about. So this is it now. So this is it now. So I can create uh, a plane, um, scale it up. So the plane, I'll take it back. I'll take the plane, um, move it back, backward. Uh, you see why I did that. So I'll go to edge, select this edge, uh, press um, shift and double click on the last edge and say press control E to um, extrude. So I have this now. So now I can go back to object mode and move this guy back like so. So coming to this side, vertex, select vertex here, come to uh, um, soft under settings, two settings, as uh, soft select and exit. So I can select multiple stuff here and bring it up uh, here. So the purpose of this um, extrusion is to have like a landscape and the purpose of having the, the landscape is to cover up any horizon um, that is behind, so that is what I'm trying to do, so that we don't see um, where the horizon is. Horizon, horizon, ira, ira. I'm sorry, I don't know how it's to pronounce that. So I'll go to object mode, then I can press three. So if I watch, uh, look at the guy from here. That that is it there. And actually, I can select all this and bring it forward. A bit more like so so i can have in this way like so so that is that is how i made it or how i did it so uh now let's texture this guy now so i can select the body go to um assign new material go to um uh, uh, ai standard and um, i can call it body rename this body Body. before you texture it, select the other one, press G. It has to repeat the last command, to give it a um, singlet, I'll say singlet. That's what we call it in Nigeria. I don't know what you guys call it. So I'll select uh, the, the short. I'll, uh, so give it AI standard and call it short. Shorts. It has to be shorts. Shorts. Sorry. So that is it. That is it. So now I can say color um, file and go to 
So I'll go to where I have the texture, uh, fuse, your bad boy, body. This is the body. Uh, I want to do. Um, is it short? Is that short? I think it's short. It's short. So that's the shot. So I'll give you the shot. Um, select this. So we have the shot. The singlet. Uh, select file. Okay. Keeps going back. Your bad boy. That's the singlet. So the body. I'll give you the same thing. Um, going to a few things, um, your bad boy body. So this is it. That is it. So also, if you notice the eyes as well, I can give it uh, the eyes. So it has to be body as well. That's where the eyes is. So, so that is it. So uh, let me just remove this for the purpose of this uh, tutorial. So I don't need it. So that is it. So I can give this uh, the same uh, texture. No, the same. Uh, I'll just change the color to green, deep green, just like a grass or something. So that is how I did it. That is how I did it. And if I move it from this side, you can see it running. So that is how it was made. So thank you guys for watching this tutorial. I hope you gain one or two things from this tutorial. Please share, uh, comment, like if you are. You say anything you want me to do. It's obvious that I don't know how to uh, animate, how to model, how to do all these things. But uh, you know you have to get work done. So I uh, try to find it, um, ways to do these things, and it's working for me. So if you um, don't know how to do any of these things as well, and want me to like something you want to do, and want me to do it for you, or you want me to explain it to you, just let me know. Comment in the um the comment section section below and let me know what you guys want me to do for you and i'll try as much as possible to do it thank you guys for watching this tutorial and we shall be meeting again in peace and not in pieces peace out guys